uh, with great pain in my heart, I bring you the news that Mariah Miller, Jimmy Miller's faithful dog and companion of 10 years, has passed on. She had an enlarged heart and some other health problems, and um, Jimmy had had to uh, have her put down. It, it's one of the the hardest thing a parent ever has to do. If you own any kind of animal, a dog or a cat, it, it's just gut wrenching. And um, he's in bad shape right now. Um, he buried her yesterday in his backyard and that's what you need to do. I myself have three animals buried in my yard and um, please please pray for Jimmy. He's a mess. I mean the man, man is uh, crying, crying, shed, shedding tears. He woke up this morning went to reach for his dog and his dog wasn't there. That's what's so horrible about this thing. You know you do things to get your mind off the death of your beloved pet and then you forget about it for a while, then all of a sudden it comes back and you remember your, pet's your pet is dead. And so please, please pray for Jimmy. I just can't even begin to tell you how much an animal meant to him. He, he you know, is a sweet, sweet animal. Okay, I've met it. I met her a couple times and Mariah was just so affectionate and so sweet. And he treated that animal, animal so, uh, so great. He treated her nice and him and Sister Sharon loved Mariah. Okay, and so I just want you to pray for him, please. I mean, this is, I think this is the worst I've seen him since I've known him. You know, this is horrible. And it's just, especially with this COVID-19 nonsense to have this dark cloud hanging over him right now. So just pray for Jimmy Miller, you know. In the Bible, even Solomon, in Ecclesiastes, uh, I think he talked about the, no one knows if the, uh, the soul of the animal goes up or down. I really can't remember the exact quote. I think it says something about the spirit of man goes upwards and the spirit of the animal goes goes down. But nobody really knows. Okay, and uh, so we don't really know what's going to happen if we're going to see our animals after we uh, pass on. I mean, God is surely able to take that DNA and put that animal back together again. You know, so uh, but please, please, please pray. You know, it's it's rough. I, I love animals. I love animals. I couldn't even, you know, I'm chairman meow, you know, I couldn't, couldn't imagine what, what it would be like to lose my animal right now. I've lost animals before. You know, so just pray, and I pray the Holy Spirit just comforts him in his time of need. And uh, please send him, a, a, you know, a comment, you know, an encouraging comment for this video, and just let him know you're praying about him and thinking about him. Let him know you love him right now. He needs... He needs a lot of prayer right now, and this is rough. He's not going to get over this uh, soon. Neither should he should. I mean, these animals are like uh, our family, you know? So, uh, 